Hello, my friends! I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Hoi for the Great War Redux mod that's currently in beta. So, last time we decided to get a few allies and go to war with the good old boys in the Ottoman Empire, which we are struggling with a little bit right now. Uh, it's only 1912, it's almost 1913, and I do have a cup of buttermint tea. We'll have drunk already, but buttermint tea with me. Let us g attempt to do the best we possibly can. Hmm. Looks like we got a piece of Montenegrin territory up north, which is nice. Uh, the Greeks have been doing very well, like I said yesterday. We have just coronated, coronated, held a coronation, and now we must integrate into Bosnia and integrate into Dalmatia. Uh, let's get Russian military advisors first, but, so a couple comments. First of all, play as communist Ottoman Empire, play as Italy different ways, play as Bulgaria and stop World War One by annexing Serbia. Cool, great ideas. I'll try to get to them if possible, maybe, maybe not. I'll play as, like, Ottoman Empire. I might not go communist, maybe I will, maybe I won't. I really have no idea at this time, at the time of this recording. I will try to hit those nations eventually, hit them hard, but, uh, we'll see what happens. I, I can't tell you what the future holds, but... We'll see what happens, you know. Cool. Uh, let's try another attack some t somewhere here. We currently are missing a couple things. Guns. Lots of guns. Because if we made these guys 20 combat with, I'd like to attack here and here. There's really no good place to attack. They're really old. They're attacking us here. That's not good. Ottomans offer terms. Oh, vi our victories over the Ottoman Empire have pushed them to the point of surrender. Oh, after over 500 years, the Balkans are finally free again. I love this. Ah, oh, that is beautiful. That is... Beautiful, absolutely. Oh yeah, this. this mm, mm, someone give me, someone help me here. I like this. And, and you know what? You know, just in case, I love my allies. I really do. I hope nothing bad comes of this. But you know what? How about we have a little bit of fun right here? Just you never know if things might go well, things might not go well. The Treaty of London has uh, won. So a comet said it. Our astronomers predicted another approach to the Earth of Halley's Comet. Every 75 years, a celestial body marked the beginning of disasters and sc scared uneducated peasants, but modern society seeks to study this cosmic phenomenon. And modern observatories and cameras will allow you to make high-quality images. An interesting phenomenon. We get stability. Is that when... Tom... Not Tom Sawyer, but uh, Mark Twain died? He came in and went out with, I think, Halley's Comet. I think I, I think I remember I learned that from American history class. Expel the Turkish... Hold on! We can expel the Turkish population. We remove persecution of the Turks. We lose manpower, but we get a little bit more. Now the Turks get more manpower. Mmm. Mmm, persecution of the... Mmm. I'm really getting my Serbian going right now. Mmm. Oh, yeah, I like that. Nationalistic agitation. Why can't we... Oh, we don't have enough political power to do this. Mmm. I kind of like this. Fight Slavic terrorists. Fight against Serbian terrorism. Ooh. What do we... Do we really have any sort of need for this stuff? Oh, we do still have that. Uh, oh, it, it'll go away eventually. I like this. That'll be nice. Oh, look at that manpower now. Oh, this stuff is all okay. It's not great. So we might as well do a little uh, questionable actions down here. Austria loses his... Wait. Rebel recruitment. I get more manpower. They lose a thousand manpower. Uh, I really like that one just because where they're going, they're not going to need manpower. Sabotage some factories. They lose 2% stability. I prefer they just lose 5%. Assassination attempt of an officer. That's not bad. Uh, you know what, for now, I'd rather just take some more stability. That'd be kind of nice. And good. Now it's a good time for us to stockpile of guns, artillery, and support equipment, but especially guns, because guns... They make people equal. Guns are nice. And if people want to mess with Serbia, then so be it. So be it. So, there's another comment from yesterday saying that I should not form Yugoslavia, make a greater Serbia. I might play as this Serbian country again, in which I will do that. But for this campaign, it will be a Yugoslavia, just because that's the way we went with for coronation. Which is, I think, a good thing. We're still mobilizing. We are. Tsar of Bulgaria leaves the Balkan pack. What? Ferdinand I believes that after the Balkan War, his country received unworthy small territories. He recalled a diplomatic mission from Serbia. Sardom of Bulgaria actually refuses to participate in the Balkan League. Oh no! Oh no! Whatever will we do? Say it ain't so. Our good old ally, why would you leave us? And there's another thing about having like a front line and shift or something. Oh. 
Oh no, Bulgaria, you're pissed off that you didn't get that much? Well, maybe you should have done more, Ferdinand. You did nothing. And people are demonstrating for women's rights. Uh, militarism, Agarian oh, National Assembly, huh. Expel the Turkish population. I'm gonna save up my political power just a little bit more first. Ooh, they need, we need more guns. Yeah, just stockpile the guns for now. Nationalist agitation. How much stability do they have? Nice. That's very nice, actually. Ooh, we could lower it even further. Let's do that. That sounds like fun. Russian advisors. Last stand. Very cool. Demand Macedonia. Oh, yeah. Well, we could try that immediately. Three inch guns sound like fun, but let's wait. So, we went with last stand. We get more organization and less out of supply. I did say I want to go with front organization for more... No, mass mobilization, because even though it doesn't give us our, like, really good infantry buffs, it gives us more population, which is nice, and helps out our cavalry a little bit. Uh, I'll get more organization. Maybe get some tanks eventually. Maybe we'll see what happens, I don't know. Where we're going, the AI usually just likes to run into our line. So much. An incredible amount. Persecution of the Turks, the world is rapidly changing. After the defeat of the Ottomans, a huge part of the Turkish population in the Balkans was left without protection. The Balkan estates, or states, remain irre Concilable, I can never speak, uh, with Turks, and thereby, and therefore, that entity caused a wave of anti Turkish pogroms, repression, and persecution. Events of the Balkans pr provoked a huge migration crisis, which did not end soon. Cool. Now, look at that, Russian advisors. I love Russian advisors. You have this division recovery rate and better winter attrition. Nice, working on the guns. Uh, yes. Egypt and the Raj want to help us out. And you guys are immediately attacking them. You know what? If you're going to attack and you might win, I might help you out. Yes. Demand Macedonia. Or Macedonia. Mexico's at war with itself again. Second Balkan War. Very nice. The Altus of Albania. Well, I can take out Albania. Definitely want to do that, maybe. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we can buy some extra guns. Let's go with the three intra guns. That'd be kind of nice. Definitely need to get a port, though. That'd be kind of nice. Beat up those Bulgarian boys. They don't deserve anything. They demand too much. And they don't do enough. Win if you can right here. Possibly. Possibly. Maybe. Maybe not. Uh, sure, Montenegro. Sure. We'll gladly accept you. Thank you. And come right there. You might be able to win. If, you po if that's possible, we're going to try to encircle two divisions. Bhutan. Of all places to help us out. I don't know why Bhutan helped us out. Who's actually leading this? Oh, Ottoman Empire. Ottoman joined the Second Balkan War. Well, that is... And so did Romania. Great. Romanian intervention. Romania's at war with Bulgaria. Great job, guys. At this point, go ahead and let everyone come in. Bulgaria asks for peace. But being surrounded by enemies, Bulgaria was, for was forced to ask for peace. Macedonia was left behind us. The advance of the Bulgarian army was stopped. Romania proposes to hold a peace conference in Bucharest to approve the borders in the Balkans and prevent another war for these lands. No mercy. Remove their faction. We punished them. Uh, they lose cores and get a claim on East Macedonia. That's not bad. Treaty of Bucharest. That might be good because we have claims on this. Do we have any claims on anything else they own? Not really. So it's probably best we just punish them for now. We need to stockpile weaponry. We must be prepared for what is to come. I do own Albania. Just, just saying. Uh, if that's the case, are they guaranteed by anyone? Because I really don't mind going to war with them if I can, really quickly, and taking them out. I'm going to leave the horses in Belgrade. Street of Bucharest, great. Early sub hole. And I do would, I would like a dockyard. So, I'm going to grab one of those, too. I would really like a dockyard. Are we done mobilizing? We are pretty much done. Yeah, they were done. They, oh, they canceled the lanes. That was so nice for us. That was so nice of them. Oh, we need one of these. Uh, German Empire, you probably don't want to give us stuff soon. But, you know, it is what it is. Whatever. Uh, sabotage, sabotage. This seems like a really dangerous decision. Attempt uh, an officer. Just give me their manpower. Cancel. Oh, oh, do you want to cancel land lease? We love each other. We're best buds. Nothing but best buds. We need more world tension. Three inch guns. Nice. Royal manifesto. Oh. That happens until December. That's cool. Serbian general staff. Nice. Prep. prep Preparations. Oh, there's no E in preparation. Well, there's not two E's, but one E. Status of Albania. Um, that auto completed. Cool. Integration. Support urbanization is good to do next so we get some more factories. That would be nice. Oh, but we can't do that first. Wait, why do this? 
Why did that auto complete? I thought we were. Oh. Interesting. Interesting. What are we building? Military factory? That's kind of nice. Next up, we're going to build just tons of trenches. Well, maybe don't. Maybe don't build 10. We're going to build quite a few nice ranger guns. So the Albanian focus canceled, but that didn't really do anything for us. Uh, so we didn't get the war goal against them, which really sucks, but whatever. Uh, cool. We will form Yugoslavia eventually. Integration, integration. Support urbanization. Ooh, but secret purchases. Let's get those factories first, and then we can buy some stuff. For now, we really just might as well do that. Thank you. Stability not looking good there, man. Check steel and guaranteed. So the UK is... Oh, they're, they are in the Entente. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. China is well Chinese. Anything else interesting to report on? Letting time go on. It's 1913. We love being at peace. We love the French because they want to support us well. They kind of want to support us. And the Russians love us. Crush the, good. Crush the strikers. They don't need anything where they're going. No, 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 no. Can we please have more uh, world tension? I would like to... Oh, crap. Of course, Italy would be trying to do that. So be it. We won't go to war with Serbia as much as I would like to. It is what it is. Cool. We want Vienna. Eventually. Montenegro. I would like to ally them, too. Now, we're going to need another army down here. Because Ferdinand, we're probably not done with this guy. Oh, you still don't get Thrace, huh? 1510 subs. Cool, we can make those if we were to actually get anything. But unfortunately, we cannot. We cannot. 1914, 1914. Uh, go ahead and make guns ahead of time. That's fine with me. Making any divisions? Because we're going to need some divisions where we are going, my friends. Just keep making stuff. Keep making more stuff. Good. I bought the steel so to help us out a little bit for artillery. Um... Hmm. Oh, we are already on pre-war economy. That's nice. Not for manpower, damage garrisons. Land for construction speed might be worth it. As well as this guy. Uh, you know what? We'll go with that. Because we might need to start building up land forts. I don't think it's going to help us here, but we'll see what happens. Uh, next up. Probably don't need those guys. No... Get that. No marines for now. Maybe eventually, but we'll see what happens. more daily army XP. Does anyone need training? A little bit, perhaps. Maybe a little bit. Horse-wise, oh my god, 10 combat width. Support urbanization, that's good. Attractors, I, oh, that's really good, but I'm going to go secret purchases so we can buy uh, more guns. So, to, in order to avoid excessive pressure from Austria, we need to plan convenient routes for the supply of arms from Russia and France. Mexico is gone. Very nice. And we are building up our trenches. Very, very slowly, but Let's be real. We go definitely gonna need them. We definitely gonna need some trenches. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Maybe eventually. Let's see what happens. I like that we have a, we are guarded by a river, which is very helpful. Very very helpful. Anything here? Cavalry would be nice for attack defense. Recovery rates okay. Maybe we can grab a thousand. Oh, there's a thousand. 60 days, two months, Jesus. They lose a thousand manpower, but we get a thousand of that manpower. That's not terrible. Influence in the Balkans, huh? They have 49%. Oh, they're doing improved worker conditions. First flight across the Mediterranean. Influence of Balkans. That does not sound good for us. So they really don't like those guys. Crush the Serbian terrorists. Archduke Ferdinand. Fred they're still going to go to war with us eventually, so... Interesting, interesting. Better artillery is always good. Always, always good. I won't do anything about that for now, since we really don't have the industry to support any more of that stuff. Let's go ahead and grab some more dispersed industries. Well, that's a little bit ahead of time, but that's okay. That's totally okay. Guns are looking pretty good. Artillery is not looking too bad, and support equipment, well, that's just support equipment for you. Let's train horses. I definitely want bigger horses. Because that'll help us... Because because they're so mobile, I think it's worth investing into these guys. Nice. And then we'll do tractors so we get some more factories to work with. That'd be nice. Oh, guns. Can I buy some guns? 
Oh, we have to be at war for that? Oh, that sucks. Has not capitulated. Oh, we get American motorized, British towed artillery, French support equipment, and Russian units of uh, guns. Well, at least that's good to know. That's very good to know, you guys. We need some thick horses. Ah, very good. Uh, let's remove you to, to at least 20 combat with for now. That's fine. So we went down this way. We got some more. We got better supply consumption, more reinforced rate. Let's get some more population. Because, you know, a third of a million is great. I love it. Not enough. Sabotage a factory. Lady lose stability. Assassination attempt. Well, it's probably not going to work, but at least he lose war support. And make him lose some more stability. That'd be nice. Hungarian arms industry. Now they attack me. Then hopefully the Hungarians rise up. Hopefully. What is Italy up to? Alpine aerodromes. Focus on airships. Fra plan. Oh, what is that? BX2? Is that 17? No. 7? Not 8? Ugh, I don't know. Oh, they, they go to war with the German Empire. That's not good. Oh, boy, that's really not good. Army efforts. All right, and Russia's doing engineering troops. America's doing what? Pilot formations. Uh, Japan is... Has no leader. Okay. And propaganda of imperialism. Hmm. Interesting. Royal Manifesto's gone. Oh, man. You got a lot of guys there. Triumvirate. Interesting. Good. Not good. Oh, boy. We need some motorized... But it could be much worse. It could be incredibly much, 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 much worse. Not looking too bad. Any upgrades? I doubt we have any upgrades. Oh, yeah, we do. Step up. Got some tractors. Oh, you have that. Yeah, that's okay. Tractors. I love tractors. And let's get into the research slot. Finally, we have four research slots we can claim to be pretty great. Just like other European nations. Don't mess with Serbia. Especially when we have defensive doctrine and unyielding defender. And we're charismatic, so we, our guys get more organization back more quickly. Let's see, we want to make our cavalry 40 combat with. We need 10 more uh, d battalions, and if we want, right? Do we need 10 more battalions? I don't know. 10 battalions make 20 more combat with. So yeah, we need 10 battalions. So we need 50 army XP. Mausers are nice, but we can't really make those yet. Happy 1914, my friends. Hope you're having a great year. I'm sure nothing bad will ever happen. Why are they so weak? For the love of God, we know I'm not going to be able to attack. And I'm not planning on it. Assassination. Oh, did that... Did we try to do it? No. Hmm, well, we could try it again. A thousand more manpower isn't really worth it. We would be at peace to do this stuff. I'd rather just hurt their stability. Because it costs them political power to do... To get more stability, so... And that could lead to strikes if they try to kill me off. So it's always good to think about that. Do we have... Yeah, we do good. We have engineers. Or, you know, some support equipment. Come on, make more guns. Make more motorized. We need everything. We have convoys. That's not bad. Yeah. I'll switch these guys out once we have enough equipment. But fortunately, we do not. The finance the University of Belgrade. A great thing. Good, good, good. And here we go, my friends. We have done it. Mountain fortresses. Oh, yeah, we definitely need that. Give me those free land forts. I love the free land forts. And I love this part. Uh, let's grab this over here. We got that going. Let's get some uh, construction speed because, well, we need to build. Lots. This this area is going to get whacked really hard because they're completely surrounded. So that's probably one of the most important areas to defend because if they break over the river, that is not bueno. Just straight up not bueno. Nice. Right, keep an eye on what's going on because it's 1914. Docks in Latina. 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 Oh, dock, in, dock yourself in Latina too. Defend the border. Sounds like a good idea. Eastern expansion, huh? So, so they support the Austro Austro Hungarian claims, alright. And now they're going to focus on the true enemy. So, activation of Schlieffen's plan will give a bonus to the attack against France. China is hurting itself and, it, and it's confusion, so be it. More critical power. Guardian of Orthodoxy. I like that, my friends. Yes, yes. Unite Ruthenia. Not a bad idea. Yeah, let's grab some. Uh, well, resource efficiency gain. That's okay. We might want some of that. 
We can't really build our forts up too well, but you know what? It is what it is. Alright, 6,000? That's not bad. That's pretty good. That's really good. This is, eh. Man, we're not going to be able to get another military factory, are we? That kind of sucks. Can anything give me military factories? I kind of doubt it. An airbase is nice, I guess. Tactical bombers, air XP, naval aircraft, pilot training. Yeah, not really. Kind of sucks. Oh, well. Strengthen civilian authorities? Nope. Airbase, naval base, radar station. Meh, that's kind of okay. We'll get this guy. Gives us more non-core manpower, even though we only own cores at this point. I really don't trust the Bulgarians, though. I really don't. Oh, man. What do these divisions look Oh, that's pathetically bad. Uh, that's a case. Do that. You might as well fill these guys all completely out if you can. Or as best as possibly you can. Those guys will have to defend down there. You know what? I'm going to put you here as well. Uh, you know what? You can defend with these guys. I really don't trust the Bulgarians. They probably won't fight us immediately. Oh, they do that. But you can't, you can't trust them. For now, I'm going to really focus on the main front, though. Have we get upgrades set to low. Oh, my goodness. Artillery is looking very nice. Ah, mountain fortifications, good. Very good. Heavy armament oh, wouldn't be bad. Pilot training wouldn't be bad. Uh, or oh yeah, let's do this. Friendship with Russia. Oh, we should have done that before. God dang it. Friendship with Romania. Yeah, let's do Orthodox Balkans. Surrender limit plus fifteen percent. We might lose a capital. Maybe. Maybe not. Let's see what happens. Oh, I really don't want to try to kill an officer. That wouldn't be very good. So we'll just make him lose some more stability. Because they currently have 45% military cooperation with Germany. They got a lot of guys. They got a ton of dudes. Russification of non titular nations. Nice. Focus on the true enemy. Naval gun effort. Airfield expansion. And y'all are doing Damascus move maneuvers. Artillery efforts. Brazil's. Well, they're focusing on airships. Nilo, huh? China's having a little KMT spat. And Japan as well doing infantry equipment. Hmm. Hmm. Romania. Yeah. You're by yourselves, that's fine. Fortification experts. <sighs> you know what? It's 10%. We might as well do that. We get a bonus to it anyways. Can you hurt their stability again? Rebel recruitment? Eh, just give me that. France? Wait, hold on. France Ferdinand. Has been... Who did that? Uh, pray for survival? Uh, he, that guy, France, while well, he's dead, his noble wife rests beside him. France Joseph has lost another heir, and to the damned vile sons of bitches that are the Serbians. The Serbian government officially denies involvement with the assassin Gavrilo Princip, blaming the Black Hand, though if you believe a lack of government involvement. I didn't do anything! Um, if not completed, ultimatum of Austria, European crisis. Bruh, bruh, you... We didn't do anything, we just want to be here and do Serbian things, man. Austria, what did you do? Did you... Is this a false flag attack? Austria... Don't blame this on us. We are just here wanting to make armored cars. I'm not sure what they do in Serbia, to be frank with you. Uh, Serbia's strong and stuff like that, but... Uh, we just want to sit here and enjoy our little Belgrade Serbian Orthodox Christianity type of lifestyle. Just kind of hanging out, defending the war. You never know if people might attack. Look at those forts over here. Beautiful. Oh, that's a lot of, entren that's a lot of trenches. If I have to move these guys around, I will. Ultimative of Austria. So Austria has sent the Serbian government a series of demands after Gavrilo Princip, who assassinated Archduke Ferdinand, implicated us. These demands would render us a little more than a puppet state. Thankfully, the Russians and French are backing us up to completely deny any competition to these old Habsburgs at all. What do we do here? Could change the world. What is your response? Serbia accepts. Pick up the puppet. Serbia will fight. And war will probably be declared. Yep, dear God, what have we done? We've done nothing. We are getting blamed for nothing because of we did nothing. UK has joined Montenegro. Uh, sure. Well then, I hope we win. Hmm. <laughs> and there goes the Germans too. Hey, we can do war bonds. 
we got a lot of good stuff up there. And I do know that we have this too. Uh, we need guns. Thank you, Russia. Support equipment. Uh, give me that artillery. I prefer that right now. Then we'll get some, some more stuff as well. Um, a lot of assassination. Tough luck for him. I'm really glad that we got trenches and forts. Even though we might not have needed it, really? Hmm. Maybe not. In any case, let's go. I'd like to build that up, but... I don't want to build it up there just because these guys might attack, so... Ah, uh, Orthodox Balkans. The best type of Balkans. Friendship with Romania. Let's do that. Let's be friends with the Romanians, because we're already friends with the Russians. Let's be friends with the R Romanians. Ah, oh, you guys are good enough artillery. I love it. Are we getting... No, oh, Germany declared one. Belgium. You guys actually pushed in already. Congratulations, dude. That's awesome, man. Oh, yeah. Yeah. S -s -s guys... I'm a poor little nation that's getting attacked by a big, angry neighbor. Please beat them up for me. And pl Russia, please hold. For the love of God, please, Russia, hold, hold, hold. Oh, no, no, no. I don't think I can take out the Germans all by myself, but you know what? We're going to die trying. Not bad. I'm loving that artillery right now, though. If that's the case, go ahead and switch it over to even better artillery. Nice. Ooh, we're going to need some of this. Russia, please, and thank you. I mean, we're winning everywhere. Opening a Panama Canal, great. Absolutely great. We don't need another general. Oh, can we get some more support equipment? Motorized, yeah, we definitely need motorized eventually. South Africa, we're buddies. Nothing's tighter than Serbian and South African relations. Absolutely nothing. Losses, well, we're defending very aggressively. <clears throat> 600 versus... 41,000. Are they being led by Conrad von Hutzendorf? They might be. Pavla? We're going to need that for where we're going. Ooh. I'm assuming our guys are learning pretty well. Infantry leader, of course. Hills fighter. Very nice. Urban assault specialist. You guys learn the same type of deal. And mountaineer, perhaps, too. Good. I like this. Cool. Can we make these horses any bigger? We could get motorized, but that requires motorized equipment that we really can't afford. Boop, boop, yep, boop, 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 and thick horses. Just these thick, thick horses. Cool, can we buy, yep, yeah, buy some of that. Thank you very much. Black hand, well, we're no, we're no longer at peace, so we gotta do that. And we'll probably do war bonds. Sounds like nice. Sounds like nice. I can't speak. No, please don't cancel the loan, lease. You're poor Serbs. We need help. Even though we're doing pretty darn well ourselves. Yeah, see, they love attacking that little tile there. Nice. Shoot every single person that comes over the border. Oh, Russia, please hold. Please do not try to attack. Please. France. Oh, for the love of God. I don't think I could, I'll be able... Ah, they actually got Mulhaus. I don't think I'd be able to really survive an attack from both Austria-Hungary and Germany. Well, maybe I could, actually. Especially they wear themselves out on our line, which always happens in this mod so far, but that's okay. And you know what? There you go. They got 10% stability. What we did earlier helped us out with delaying their, you know, stability of the nation, quite literally. U.S. Declaration of Neutrality. They have mutinies, which is a tremendous thing because now they have, well, the KMT is capitulated, but they have minus some percent. Oh, they just got rid of it. God dang it. Well, they minus like 25% attack, so that's kind of good. Give me war bonds. King Carol the First died. Long live, long live King Ferdinand. Friendship with Romania. Belgrade Pact. Uh, probably not. Let's get friendship with Russia. I love the Russians. We have lost 3,000 Serbs. Too many. Too many. Way too many. Ah, yes. Romania. I'm sorry about your king. He was a good guy. But Ferdinand the First, hey man. Hey. We buds. You know, remember that time we took out Bulgaria together? That was great. Nutrition. Wait, more recruitable population. Yeah, buddy. Tachanka tactics? Nice. That's not going to help us at all except for cavalry recovery rate and soft attack. Which is bueno. Which. Oh, oh, we can buy more stuff, yeah. Buy more Russian guns. The Russian guns, amazing guns, you know. Especially when we need more stuff here, too. Ooh. That's a lot of, uh. That's really quite a bit of, uh. Something there. I can't think anymore. As soon as I said it, it went out of my mind. Anyone level four? 
Come on, Austria. Come on, Franz Joseph. Uh, oh, uh, Russia. I don't like this, Russia. I really don't. Especially if Russia capitulates, we might not be able to buy any more guns. Buy some more support equipment. That'd be nice. I love the French. The French are great, aren't they? If Russia, if Russia capitulates, there might be a Soviet Union that pops up. That would really not be good for us or the French. If the Romanians get in the war, that wouldn't be bad, but that might open us up too. I don't know if Serbia can really hold the entire central powers against everyone else. But we'll see what happens. I have no idea. Improved artillery, great. Kill them even harder. That's way too ahead of time. 1914. Uh, fuel? We're not really using fuel. We don't believe in planes. Get that one. Better reinforce rate. Oh, that is good that I looked at this. If that is the case... Oh, hold for now, for the love of God. I'm sending you reinforcements. Not much right now, but that's okay. Good. Wait, they're shooting down. Planes? Do we have planes? I don't remember the government... Yeah, we don't have no planes. Whatever, 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 all right. Only 27 planes a day. Or guns a day, that's not much. Artillery is okay. Get some motorized, because even though we have surplus, we're not always going to have surplus. We don't even have the factories to build them. Nice. Good. We need a... Oh, well, we'd like to get another general, but we can't really afford it right now. Good job, guys. Good job. How well... How much entrenchment do, do the horses have? Uh, didn't really say, does it? Oh, that's five. The Mountaineers have five as well, so... Eh. Armored cars, very good. Armored car two is very good. If that's a case... I'm going to put you here. I'm going to put you here. Because you... Just in case. Even though we are probably defending hills here as well. I really want those mountaineers to be dug in. Like, really dug in by the time we go to war with these guys. You know, if we really don't need these, I'm just going to continue building ourselves up for now. We might need it against Bulgaria, though. But, anyways. So we did that. Ask protection of... I mean, we could try that. I mean, we already kind of are in the Entente, aren't we? Eh, we'll do it anyways, because we can. Yes. Give me the guns. Yes. Motorized. Looking pretty good. Support equipment's looking even better. Hmm. We can do that, too. We get how much political power? 1.48 a day. That's not bad. Good. Ah, Egypt. Yes, Egypt. Our good friends, the Egyptians, would never hurt us. Oh, not to to train. Excavation dose. The Egyptians are good friends of the Serbs. Could request more. Oh, 300 more support equipment. That's pretty nice. Not gonna lie, that's pretty good. Mm, armored cars. We're not really gonna waste stuff on that. Change anything here. Export focus. Resource wise, I mean, we're pretty good. We might as well stay with whatever we have right now. Cavalry, that's not bad, but I could just use more guns. Support equipment, we're making enough for now. That we should be okay. Cool. I want to keep the horses here because they can entrench pretty darn well. So we'll leave them here, get them back on the line over there. That's going to be good. And he's becoming an infantry leader in Hills Fighter. That's kind of nice. Steppa? Oh, yes. I love adaptable so much. Terrain penalty reduction plus 30%. So good. Infantry leader. Yes, please. Level 5. Very good. Russia is... Well, they're not out of the fight. They've lost some territory, but not bad. Losses thus far, though. 11,000. Too many Serbs. Too many Serbs. 400,000 Austro-Hungarians. Mostly done by us. Russia's pathetic. That's okay. Just don't... Don't tell them I said that. You know. As much as I love their guns... They just give up too fast. Motorized support equipment. Well, motorized. Well. We don't need a lot of motorized right now. This is what we really need. Guns, guns, guns. Oh, well. Bad word. If that's a case. Throw these guys on and then throw these guys on. Now we're going to buy some more stuff. Yes, Mozilla guns. Good. We're going to need that. We're going to need a lot more of that. Mmm. Okay, there it goes. Look at all the support equipment and motorized we need now. Hmm. I'm spending a lot of money. And by money, I mean political power. Nice. That helps us out. That, that'll definitely actually help us out with our casualties, which won't be too bad. The Ottoman state. Oh, Russia's now in a two-front war. That's not bueno. 
But hey, the British are down here, the Egyptians are down here, that's kinda nice. Thanks, Brits. Thanks, Egyptian guys. Nice. Uh, whatever, cool, again. Let's do integration into Dalmatia, because let's just be real here. Eventually, we might be owners of that area. Do we need any more artillery? We really don't. We should only have one line. Good. Keep that for now. That would be nice. Yeah, we're going to save our political power up. Alright, so these guys make stuff. I definitely need you to be over here. Like, for the most part, we can hold. And they're not really giving us any trouble. So, let's see, maybe bait them in a little bit. Belgrade, do you want to attack the capital city? Good luck with that, son. Well, I'll just research the first tank. Good stuff. Can we grab? No? Okay. So, not bad. The guns are doing better. Motorize is doing terrible, but we'll get there. And its support equipment? Well, hmm. Not bueno. Steppa. He's learning a lot. These generals, great generals. Just great. Actually, if we have these guys, grab one of these. Kostya. Kostya. Nice. Yeah, I really don't trust the Bulgarians still. Good, 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 good. What if I told one of these guys to leave? Oh man, look how weak they're getting. Holy cow. And Italy is not helping them out. Oh, look, Rusilov offensive. Okay, cool. Cool. They're out of manpower. Nice. You guys definitely are not, and you guys... Oh, you got a good amount of manpower. Uh, the French are actually trying to push out of Belgium into Pittsburgh. Huh. Wow, that looks really bad for these guys. That looks insanely bad. Can we try one attack? Now, I don't want to attack here. This is too dangerous. It's already looking bad, so we're not going to do that there. These guys can. You might be successful right here. Maybe success? If not, that's totally okay. One. I don't want to cause any unnecessary casualties. You hold. You also hold. Uh. 71. 68. 72, that's not bad. You guys might actually do really well right here, especially with these guys helping you out. How about right here? If we can expand our lines a little bit, that'd be really nice. When the Austro Hungarians have already lost over half a million people, that's not bad, that's really good. France has lost a lot, Russia has lost. Where are those, those, those guys? Eh, half a million. Eh, that's Russia though, what do you expect? If we can push out of our little area here, and have a nice little. Oh, that's nice. Defensive line, that'd be awesome. Go ahead and build up it in Serbia, that's fine. Infantry equipment, support equipment. And that's all we can afford until we can get some more motorized equipment. Come on guys, you got this, please. No, no, you're failing. That's okay, that's okay. Can't win everywhere. Return this direction. Can you guys actually... Yes, you can help the deck there. Nice. You up here might be able to win still. Uh, Montenegro, I would highly not advise you to do that. We won right here. Beautiful. And integration into Bosnia. Help push over the river. I should have sent everyone there to help push. Nice. Good. Japan is on our side in this war. That makes actually quite a bit of historical sense. Oh, that's weird. That's very weird. Uh, it's 400 days. Just go ahead and do it. Screw it. It's important. Come on, guys. You got this. We did it. Now, we like to push this way, but we'll see what happens. But unfortunately, that's all the time that we have for today. What have we done? Well, World War One has started. The French are being incredibly aggressive. The Russians are trying to hold out. We have also expanded just a tiny bit. Serbian glory. But I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow as we might see Russia struggle and maybe we can expand some more. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.